Now I'm going to show you how to braid over the top of your paracord bracelet. Um, this rope actually is a true 550 cord. Um, like I said below, the white is a 650 cord. And I'm just going to show you real fast. The 550 cord actually has seven strands in it, and the 650 cord only has um, four strands on the inside. So on this rope, it's eight feet. I'm going to go ahead and put it in half here, and then I'm going to put it underneath. Okay, then I'm going to take one side and I'm going to loop it over. I'm going to bring this side over and then I'm going to bring it up underneath the loop on the other side. Okay. Now on the next one, I'm going to loop this side over. I'm going to go over, and then I'm going to go under. This is actually what's called coxcombing. Sometimes people call it cobra braid, um, but we call it coxcombing. Then I'm going to take this one over, cross it, go underneath the other side. This one, so you're going to do just the opposite, over top, cross this one over and go under. And you're going to continue to do this. This will get kind of fast here. Continue to do it all the way down the bracelet. So once you get good at it, you can go pretty fast. And I'm doing this pretty loose, but you can actually tighten it up if you don't want to show the rope that's underneath, or you can loosen it up even more. For the sake of this demonstration, I'm just going to do it loose so that we can whip through it real fast. And again, this is eight feet of 550 cord that's on the top. Um, you can use more rope and tighten it up if you'd like. Um, every bracelet's going to be a different size based on the person you're making it for. An average adult probably is about seven and a half feet if you're pretty good um, about cutting your rope. And I have this taped to the counter just to kind of anchor it. Um, at home, sometimes I use my knees and just put it between my knees. There's all different kinds of ways you can anchor it. Okay, so if you wanted to tighten it, you could push this down and tighten it and make more, or you can loosen it up, just depending on how you want the braid to look. I kind of like a medium type of braid on mine. Okay, so you're going to go all the way to the end. Then what I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to untape this or slide this out. And I'm just going to take this end, melt that piece of rope down. And I always use a piece of marble because it kind of gives it a nice finish. And I just roll it around and that makes it kind of look nice and crisp. Then on the other side I'm going to take it, heat it up melt it down and again kind of roll it on the piece of marble so it gives it a good look. Then when you're done you can snap it together and then there you have your paracord bracelet.